Whoa! It's the illusion reporting from somewhere on Spaceship Earth. Sitting on the side of the Pacific Coast Highway, checking the surf. The sun's setting, but it's like almost a full moon. So I possibly could surf into the dark. But it's super inconsistent out there, South Swell. I don't know. I don't know. Ah, here's a couple waves. What do we got? Ah, it's not all that. So anyway, you talk about blowing it sometimes. I can be such a botch, a complete botch. I don't know. Me and the uh, me and the hologram got into a big argument about the mini grams education this morning or this mid morning. <sighs> I don't know. It could all, it could all go in a different direction, but again, I'm the squeaky wheel. I'm the troublemaker dude, which just starts off a whole chain of events. It just, ah, oh, geez, Jiminy crickets, man. You know, I'm, I'm invested in, 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 in my stepdaughter. Like I want nothing but the best for, and I might be, a, <coughs> I'm a little tough. So we got this ongoing thing with math, math. Oh, dude, it's just this on, dude, I've been battling her about math for going on three solid years now. It's so gnarly, dude. It's like the one thing that really causes friction in our household. And I've tried to do the whole like step away from the thing too and let her mom be the enforcer about this kind of stuff. But sometimes I just I can't help myself. You remain silent too long, man. All of a sudden you start building up some like, I got some resentments about it, man. I need to work on it. It's not a high frequency vibe, dude. You know, so what's been going on is she struggles with math, but her mom always thought she was sort of like incapable of doing math, but I know her and she's not. She's actually a really smart child. Did I? Yeah, I said child. Awesome. And uh, so I, you know, in the beginning, I was fully like when she was in public schools, she was getting smoked and Common Core wasn't helping her. And so I would like take her under my wing and it was all like when the multiplication started and I would make these like multiplication tables for and stuff. And I'm a big believer in flashcards, but for some reason she wouldn't touch the flashcards, like full defiance. Like if you're like of all the battles to pick, like to, to be defiant one it's like the, like the one that's like least helpful in my book to your like future like ah like yeah she does the dishes and her laundry and cleans up her room now and all that stuff i just wish she wasn't but so anyway anyway i i wish i wish i wish i'm the problem here so Ah, uh, the math, so she refused to do the flashcards, so she ref doesn't really have her times tables dialed, so she struggles, and then she gets in, she cracks under pressure, like that was one of the reasons we pulled her from public school, is because the, the math scene was just carrying on into all the other classes, and poor, poor, poor child, man. I feel like bad for her, dude, in that sense, but again, it's not because she can't do it. So, homeschooling, the math was again the big sticking point. And I would give these like talks of like, look, dude, you got all this other stuff. You can, you're, you're smart. You can do all that, but we got to make space for the math. And we held her back a year. And it was just like pulling teeth, man. Like pulling teeth to get her to do the math. And then eventually, dude, so she was playing the card of like she can't do it, but we held her back a year. So she's already done sixth grade math. She's in seventh grade. She's already done sixth grade math. So it's like, it's a reboot. We're just doing what we did last year. So it's not a struggle. 
And it became this whole thing at the beginning of the year where she was claiming she couldn't do it. But then push came to shove, she would do it. And it turned out it just was because she didn't want to do the work because, you know, multiplication and division requires you to write numbers down. Like you got to do some work. You got to do some work, man. It's, it's all, but because she wouldn't refuse to learn her multiplication table, she would always sit there and struggle with these things. And bam, 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 bumping heads, bumping heads, bumping heads. To resist is to suffer. The more she resists, the more I get pissed. The more she resists, the more I get pissed. Ah! Mushroom clouds, man. So whatever, man. I stepped off a little while wise because it was really causing trouble around the house, man. It's depressing me. It was making her frustrated. It was just this spiral of like bad vibes, dude, about the math. And dude, she's a horse girl. Like I know she's not a math mathematician, but like the basics, like the basic stuff, you got to get dialed, man. Anyway, so last Wednesday couple days ago I just got got on her case about it all right but she took I got on her case we got into a full argument I apologized the whole thing we worked it all out her mom gets crazy when we get into this when we get into it and uh she went and did her math dude right like she went and did it because she can do it like all right this is this is where me as get my screws pop out of the side of my head. She can do it. She's fully capable, dude. And when push comes to shove, she will absolutely go and do it. So she went and did the math on Wednesday. So today, she's like splitting for the weekend to go hang out with her friends all of a sudden. And I was, I was like, oh, here comes a set. What do we got? Eh. And she was splitting to her friends. And I was like, well, how much math does she turning got done and then it was the whole like the excuses started and I was like dude come on man and then the hologram was like no 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 she struggles and I go but dude she did the math the other day when I got on her case like I don't get I, I, I'm sensing BS dude it's just the struggle, dude. And then it just all came unglued, dude. It just... <sighs> super bad vibes, man. Like, super bad vibes. Failed. Failed at the dream, dude. If I talk about the revolution being at the dinner table, like... <sighs> well, we blew it. And so, you know, it's just a full, like, friction day. Which blows, man. No one needs that. Didn't get any math done. That's for sure. <laughs> Fire Rudy. So, no, I don't know, man. I gotta let it go, dude. You know, I, I, got, I gotta let it go. I don't know why I'm so wound up about it. It's because I do care. I mean, ultimately, that's... I do care about her future. And I'm like, dude, you need to know your math just, just to get paid. Just to be able to get paid in this world. It's gnarly, man. It's like this one radical thread that can just unravel the whole sweater. So it was a fail. Full-blown fail today, dude. Like, zzz, zzz, right around, like, noon. Noon fail. But, you know... I'm, I'm just like everybody else, man. I'm just trying to figure it all out. I'm just trying to figure it all out, man. <sighs> we, we, we regroup. That's all you can do is regroup. Regroup, regroup, regroup. I wish the surf was a little bit more consistent. I'd be out there. I'm going to do one of those. If there's a parking spot, I'm going to paddle. <laughs>